Hello everyone. Welcome to Indian Polity Mastery. My name is Gautam and Mohan. Today we are going to discuss about the ordinance making power of the president. So, what do you mean by ordinance making power or what do you understand by the term ordinance making power? You might have heard about this term before in the newspaper and all, but what it exactly means? It means exactly like a legislation. So, it is almost similar like a legislation only so legislations are uh, mainly passed by the uh, the parliament okay the parliament consists of the lok sabha rajya sabha and the president so we used to get the legislations from the parliament so same like that the president is also enjoying a power called ordinance making power so that is also a legislation so what is the constitutional provision for this ordinance article 123 of the indian constitution Article 123 of the Indian Constitution talks about the ordinance making power of the president. So the president of India can promulgate ordinances during the recess of the Parliament of India. So what do you mean by the recess of the Parliament of India? It means the recess of the Parliament refers to when both houses of the Parliament, that is the Lok Sabha and the Rajya Sabha, or any one of the two houses, that is either Lok Sabha or Rajya Sabha, is not in session. So we all know about how a legislation is actually passed in a parliament. So it has to be passed in one particular house, that is Lok Sabha. Then it has to move to the uh, other house, and there also it should be passed. Then it will uh, go to the assent of the president. So the assent has to be given. The president has to give the assent. So one once the bill receive the assent of the president, it will become an act. So the legislation is completed. So that is a process. That means both the houses are actually included. in this particular process so if both the houses are actually absent or not in session or if any one of these houses are not in session then this legislation will not uh, work out so that is why during that particular time period if there is an emergency the emergency in the sense an urgent need of a legislation exists then the president can actually promulgate the ordinance the ordinance making powers of the president are not discretionary in nature And the president can promulgate ordinances only on advice of the Union Council of Ministers. So we all know about one important provision in the Constitution, that is the Article 74 of the Constitution, which actually talks about the the Council of Ministers to aid and advise the president. So same like that, the Council of Ministers is there to advise the president regarding ordinance also. All ordinances issued by the president cease to operate unless laid before the before and ratified by both the houses of the parliament within 6 weeks from the reassembly of the parliament so that means within 6 weeks of the reassembly of the parliament it has to be passed it has to be accepted by both the houses of the parliament then only it will exist otherwise it will cease to operate so it will end or it will become a invalid one the president can withdraw an ordinance at any time so these are some of the important information regarding the ordinance making power of the the president so we have we have seen many ordinances which are actually passed in the in the country not only at the central level that means in the union level but also at the state level also so in the state level if you look at who is the person who is actually promulgating ordinances who has the power to promulgate ordinances it is the governor has the power to promulgate ordinances in the state so article 213 of the constitution which talks about the ordinance making power of the governor hope you have got an understanding regarding the ordinance making power of the president every aspects of indian polity and indian constitution we will try to discuss in this channel so that you will get more understanding regarding our constitution and you will be more equipped to write the examination the upsc civil services examination and other competitive examinations so please subscribe our channel and also enable the bell icon so that you will get notification regarding all the upcoming videos thank you